Welcome to week nine of our training. Today we are glad to have Asian Wushu Youth Champion Pearly here with us to teach us some Wushu this week. Nice. Can we start now? Not yet. Before we start, we should learn that ethics and morality are very important in Wushu. So the first thing I'm going to teach you guys is how to salute. First off, stand straight like this. Widen your chest and tighten your core. Open your left palm with four fingers held tight, and bend your thumb towards your palm. Make the fist with your right hand, with your thumb covering your four fingers. Put both hands against each other and place them in front of your chest. This is the salute. Now let's warm up our body. Since we are mainly doing arm movement today, we will focus on warming up our arms and hands. First off, we will do shoulder circles. Place your hands on your shoulders and rotate them forward. Do this for ten repetitions and repeat it for two times. When you are done, rotate them backwards with the same sets and reps. Next, hold your hands together and rotate your wrists for 10 seconds. Rotate in both directions to completely warm up your wrists. Again, for each direction, do this for 10 reps and repeat it for two times. Since it is the first day we train, we will start off with some easy arm movement first. To make a fist, bend the four fingers towards your palms, just like you are doing a thumbs up gesture. And then cover those fingers with your thumb. Remember, don't put your thumb inside your fist to avoid injuring yourself when you punch. Alright, the first movement is punches. Stand with your shoulder width apart. Place your fist with thumbs facing up at your waist level, slowly. Throw the punch by rotating your arms. As you throw the punch and extend the arm, your thumb should face downwards at the end of the movement. Again, same movement for the other side. For each set, alternate both arms while punching. 1, 2, 3, 4. That's it. Our second drill today is to push our palms. Merge the four fingers and bend your thumb towards the palm. Same for both hands. Again, stand shoulder width apart and place your palms facing up the sky at your waist level. Slowly push your palms out so that it faces the front. Same for the other side. Do 10 times one set. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's it. Other than punches and palm pushes, there is also a hook movement. To do a hook, merge all your fingertips together and point them downwards. We will combine hook together with the previous two movements. First, throw the punch. Then, open your fist with fingers straight and palms slightly facing forward. Raise your arms and put them down at the side to your shoulder level with a hook hand gesture. Finish the whole movement by returning and once more. Punch, open your fist, raise your arms, and do the hook, and finally return. Now, we will combine the previous three movements for a proper wushu drill. First off, stand shoulder width apart with both fists at your waist. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. Now, we will move on to palm push. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. And we will complete fist, palms, and hooks. This is the whole movement combining the skills we have learned just now. Repeat this for three sets. Let's relax our arms after finishing all those drills. First, extend your arms with your palm facing forward and fingers pointing in the sky. Grab your palms with your other arm and pull towards your body. Alternate both sides and stretch for 10 seconds. Repeat this for three times. We learned the basics of Wushu today. They are very important if you want to master Wushu. Let me practice more at home. See you guys tomorrow.